Tangband sent me these two speaker modules. It is the T1-1828 SD speaker module. Just over two inches square. They're really tiny. But the interesting feature is that it's completely enclosed speaker. It has a small passive radiator on the back and essentially you could just connect this up to a small amplifier without even mounting it into an enclosure. I decided to build a small Bluetooth speaker with these to test its capabilities. However, this project is a bit of a fail, to be honest. For now, you can watch me build this and in the end you'll see why I say that it's a fail. Here you can see uh, I'm just making this up as I go along. I just planned more or less what I was going to do in my head. Uh, these modules only produce about 4 to 8 watts max, so it's not very powerful. However, they really have a physical punch to them. When I initially connected these up to a small amplifier, these things kick. They are not very loud and don't go extremely low, but I was surprised as to the low end capability of such a small speaker. What I am building here is just the structure to hold the sound modules because they are self-contained units and don't need an enclosure. I'm just cutting a front baffle and a rear panel with a few spaces in between. The void in the middle will house the small 8 watt per channel Bluetooth amplifier module. Here you can see me make a marking out the section that I want to cut out on the back panel. Uh, but I ended up just drilling a big hole. This is so that I can get to some of the connections of the amplifier.
These pieces are small feet that I'm gluing to the back panel. I cut them at an angle so that the speaker will face upwards at an angle towards you. Okay, so let's just freeze there for a moment. I also got these two speaker modules from Tang Band. They are the T1-1828S speaker modules. They're a little bit bigger than the ones that I'm currently using, but the specifications are more or less the same. I have no idea what I'm going to do with them. So if you have an idea for a project where I can include these, please leave me a comment down below. So I'm just going to quickly do a little bit of a sound test here and uh, then you guys will also see now why I say that this project is a little bit of a fail. So when the music starts to uh, get a little bit loud, uh, <laughs> this thing actually vibrates on the table and moves around. Uh, these little speakers are incredibly powerful. So, uh, uh, But let me run a few songs for you and uh, then you can uh, see what it, what it does.
listen. Uh, but as soon as I take my hand off it, it starts to vibrate and uh, it ruins the sound completely. So these little small units are incredibly powerful. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed that. That was a lot of fun. Um, as you can see, these uh, Tang Band sound modules are incredibly powerful. However, if you want to use them in anything, you need to make sure that you're mounting them very, very securely and that they are mounting to something that's not going to vibrate and that's fairly heavy so that it doesn't move around. Uh, well, great. I hope you enjoyed that. Please let me know what you think I can do with those other sound modules uh, down in the comments below. Um, and until next time, adios.